Hadn't watched the tape, so I can't really comment on that. He obviously had a big ball game, made some big shots, and uh, we didn't do enough to stop him. But credit to him, tip your cap to him. Played great, had a wonderful game, and uh, we didn't do enough to stop him. Overall, uh, what's just your take on, you know, you guys got down early, but what was just your take in general about the effort that was given out there, just the execution that, that you saw particularly early on? Well, uh, first half, I didn't think we flowed into our offense with any kind of pace. Uh, whoever had the ball was trying to make a play for themselves. We got a little uh, selfish at times in the first half, but still wind up getting 50 points and kind of hung around. But uh, made a conscious effort in the second half. Didn't, it didn't happen right away, but we grinded it out. Went through Brook, you know, made some uh, offensive plays that kept us in the ball game, and uh, you know we grinded it out, got back into the game. But uh, you know, Brook fouling out, not having him in the post. But uh, hey, we had an opportunity late. I thought we had a couple of execution glitches uh, on some side out of bounds that uh, we could have got some free looks at threes. But uh, you know, we watched the last uh, two thirty minutes uh, of the game uh, right after I came off the floor just to you know, teach them situational type basketball, what to look for. And, uh, you know, it's glaring when you watch it because you can see it, but uh, we just have to be better at it. In your mind, uh, the second half of a back-to-back against a guy as athletic as Russell, did that play a factor or was it? No, man. Uh, no, don't even go there. Uh, we, we, it's the NBA type season, NBA type game, back-to-back. All right, we can't take, you know, say we were tired. No. No, it has nothing to do with it. And the guy had a great game. Let's, let's just leave it at that. Brook fouling out was so huge. Does he have to stay on the court there? His six Not miles? necessarily. I mean, he was trying to be aggressive. Uh, obviously, we wanted him up on pick and rolls. And, you know, it just got a little too physical and, and got some uh, some cheap fouls late. Over the last, what have you, two and a half minutes or whatever, were you talking about the mistakes down the stretch? Were those physical or were they mental? It was not. It was not physical. Uh, it was all mental. Uh, situation in basketball, you got to know what you're looking for. We, we didn't have that many timeouts left, and we were trying to make sure if we didn't have timeouts, we were getting quality shots and certain actions that we were running. So, uh, no. Physical, no. Who were you pleased with on your club? Say what? Who played well on, on your club? Who were you happy with? Uh, you know, it was a few people that gave us some good effort out there. Uh, I, I thought Bogey was solid. Uh, I thought, uh, you know, the kids, Kilpatrick, came off the bench, gave us some good minutes. Um, you know, we just uh, we had stages where we had mental lapses with turnovers and you know not making the right basketball plays uh, uh, down the floor. So, uh, hey, when I look at the tape, I could probably give you a better answer. But uh, off the top of my head, I thought Brooke gave us a great effort. Uh, the Kilpatrick kid gave us some good minutes. Obviously, Thad Young played his behind off and uh, you know kept us in the game.